What is up everybody, my name is Fritchie and welcome to Go Lions, an action adventure RPG created by Octus 3, a small indie game company known for their unknown games like Golden Arts and Robot Arena 3. Anyways, I'm really excited for this game, it came out yesterday on Steam and the price for this game is around $90.99. But the game got 20% discount right now so you can get this game now for only $50.99. But first, watch this video so you know if it's worth it. Anyways, if you want to check out all other indie game episodes, just click the annotation at the top or go to the cards on the top right of your screen. Also, I made a poll there about what you think of this game. Let me know in the comments section below and be sure to like if you enjoyed. Anyways, let's begin with this wonderful game. So here we go. So it starts off with a pretty tragic kind of World War II thing going on right now. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, this kind of reminds me of World War II. Some, some way. Okay, I see an island. Okay. Interesting. And there we start. Okay, we see a plane and an island and now it starts. Okay, here we go. I had a lot of trouble running this game with fraps on. I like my PC free, it froze a lot of times. Um, the sound didn't work. I couldn't play it and stuff like that. But now we can, finally. And I'm really excited for this game. Uh, the game is on Ultra, so hopefully Fraps can run it. Please. Hopefully it's not freezing. It froze. Oh no, it didn't. Okay. <laughs> the game didn't froze. <laughs> I can almost catch my breath right there. And it froze again. <laughs> Great. And now it is working. Man, this game is kind of stupid. But here we go. We're finally playing Goliath. And I'm really excited for this game. We got five frames per Oh my god, this game looks absolutely beautiful. It, it reminds me a lot of uh, Borderlands. Yeah, Borderlands, definitely. Definitely reminds me of Borderlands. So you can chop trees and get res resources. So let's do that. By pressing E. Oh my god, the animation looks so smooth and they look pretty cool. Okay, so we got ourselves Resin, a twig. Some locks, some more locks. Oh, bunny, 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 come here. Die, bunny. Die, bunny. Are you a bunny? Bike, bunny, bunny, come here. Bunny, bunny. Don't, don't run away from me, bunny. Don't, don't run away. How can I, can I, can I? Can I kill it? Oh, headshot that bunny. Ha <laughs> ha. That's how I do it. Man, I really like this game. I haven't just played it yet. Jesus Christ. Hopefully it's worth it because it's around $16.99 or oh, no, yeah, $60 but $20 on fucking normal price. It's, that's really expensive for such an unknown game so the expectations are very high right now. Okay, so now we need to get up berries. Um, I never heard of berries but I guess you can find them at the bushes. Somewhere. Can we rotate? Oh my god, this game looks beautiful. I'm playing on Ultra right now so yeah, I have a pretty good PC. Even though I'm not playing on full resolution because it will crash my fraps or somehow for some reason. So uh, bear in mind that the quality can be a little bit blurry right now. That's just because I had to uh, change the resolution. Because the game otherwise don't play. Um, so I don't know what happened here but... Okay, still haven't found any berries. I'm like checking these bushes. But this game is really cool. Um, the cool thing is Goliath actually got featured on the first page of Steam yesterday. That was really cool actually. Like this game came out uh, yesterday and I really like it so far. It's really easy to play. I re you just have to get her waiting for rescue. Uh, what the fuck is that? Kill it! For lazy axe! Fucking hell die! Ooh! Oh you like that fucking bitch. Mm. Mm. Oh what you gonna do huh? Oh, whoa, he got a gem. Damn, this bird is fucking rich. 
Oh, the gold, gold, gold bird, something like that. <laughs> a gold, a gold bird. Okay, I'm, I'm still waiting to get myself some berries because that's what we want to gather. Oh, there are the berries. Oh, is that an apple? I see an apple thing on my mini map right now, but I don't know what it is. Oh yeah, yeah, we got berries. Okay. There we go. And we got the berries. Set up a camp near the crash site. Okay. So, I guess we got crashed. Or, that was also a little plane. The, on the black, white, black and white scene there. So basically we now need to um, build ourselves a camp fire. I don't know how we're going to do that. But, we need to press 1, I guess. Oh, okay, it's that easy. Basically, I already made a fucking tent in about two seconds. Wow. Make coil, make hole with logs and branches in the bonfire. Okay. Well, we got some branches and we got some logs. And now we got coil. Great. Okay. That's how it... Ah. Yes, I get it. Okay, we got enough coil now. I guess we do. Okay, now we do the coil and put it in, I guess. You can craft items in the tent. Make medicine. Okay, how are we gonna make medicine? Healing ointment. Okay, craft. And now we got a beautiful... Yeah, release... Oh, we reached level 2! Yay! Oh, what the hell? We got a cutscene. Oh no, we don't. Um, answer the call. Uh, how do I answer? Uh, mama. Okay, I need to go to the... Uh, fuck. Hopefully he stays on the phone. Because I'm a little bit too slow. Anyone there? What? A radio? Could it still be working after that crash? And who could it be calling me? Oh my hat! Hello, hello, do you hear him read me? This is Gromov. Gromov, Gromov, you made it buddy! I thought we were going us. Where are you? Well, I'm, I'm right by the plane, but before I ask where you are, uh, who are you? Man, you must have gotten clunked on the head pretty hard, don't you remember me man? It's me, Dave! Dave, oh, oh yeah, I'm a little confused right now. Um, you're my co-pilot, right? Where are you? I got thrown free when the plane broke apart. I landed in the forest somewhere and I banged up uh, in a safe place. I'll be okay on once I rest a little. Frankly, I, I don't know how I'm still alive. Okay, what should we do? What do we do so much? Hold on a second, I need to get my story straight. You and I were flying this plane, right? Yeah, I was your co-pilot. We were on the test run, something about the experimental engine. It's a little fuzzy, I think we got bigger fish to fry here. The signal is strong as when I go to the south, so I'm thinking you need need to come send north for me. Okay, I, I'm coming, I'll be right there. Wait, wait, don't be so hasty. Have you seen the kinds of monsters that are in this place? If you come straight here, you'll be eating faster than you say, no, no, please don't eat me. To be perfectly honest, I don't think we're in France, Europe, or even Earth anymore. We need to figure out what's going on, how to survive, and then how we how to get home. Okay, so what do we do? I save here, uh, so make make yourself safe there. Get the supplies you need from the surrounding areas, and then we can start figuring out how to meet up. Okay, solid plan. Okay, so next up, go north. We got a mushroom. Can we? What happens if we eat it? Of course, we will fucking poison out and shit. Okay, here we go, guys. We're going on adventure. We got a gun. The only thing we got... Oh. And there's a first encounter. <laughs> wow. A fucking... What the hell is that? An elephant thing? You made it safely inside the fuselage of the plane. The monster beats on the outside mercilessly, mercilessly while you cower in the cockpit. In front of you there are, are an array of switches, throttles and buttons. And there appears to be a tiny bit of gas in the cat tank and juice in the battery. Activate landing gear, wiggle the control stick and pedals, hit the ignition. Uh, landing gear? Donk, the little kid pops out and boops the monster in the nose. The monster is surprised, annoyed and confused, but not hurt. It continues to bash the plane. Try something else. Uh, hit the ignition. Kachung! The undamaged right engine turns over. Something inside it explodes with force that tears off the wing. Smashing the monster in the face and knocking it down for the count. You're safe. Nice work. Hmm, it sure is less stressful to beat on monsters when I'm safe inside some sort of armor. I have to think about this. Oh, fuck. Hmm, that's way better than my thing. I just started a fire and cooked the fish. Well, anyway, nice work. What are you doing, going to do now? Uh, I had an idea that I'm going to gather myself some lumber and metal and see if I can 
if I can mm, armor myself so that I can be safe walking through the monster infested lands around here. I'm thinking that I want to make some smashing weapons so that I can crush the coals of any creature that looks at me funny. Hold on a second, how about both? Being armored and invulnerable plus having the smashing powers, that will be amazing! So will you be afraid of everything? Of anything? You could walk all over this monster world. Say you're right! Let me see if, we, if I can find a safe place to get materials together and build something. If I only, if only I knew where it will be safe. Ah, I think I know this. There are some ob obelisks around the world that the monsters don't go close to. So you could have a pretty safe work, to, uh, a safe area to work. I think I saw one to the north of here. Thanks Dave, I'll talk to you soon. Okay, and there is the bitch lying on the fucking thing. I don't even know what the hell it is. Let's talk with it. Hi there monster. How, how you doing? I, I just want to talk with you. Oh, uh, I like your teeth. I, I, I really like your teeth. They're, they're so beautiful. Okay, here we go. Um, can we also, like, pan out? Okay, here we go. Da, 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 da. Okay, we got him in a fucking circle right now. Doesn't sound strange at all. You reached level 3. That's the place where Dave was talking about. Teleport device. What will it do? Build a Goliath construct. Press 1 inside the glowing circle. Okay, so now we need to make a Goliath con Oh. My. God. Wait. Did we make a robot? Can we make robots in this game? This is your Goliath construct. Here you can build Goliaths from different parts of your broken Goliaths. Oh my god. We can make fucking robots. Okay, we need a lock. Let's get ourselves a lock. That's awesome. Oh, what's this? Oh, look at all these chests. We got money. And we got money. Oh, look at that. More fucking parts that we can use. More things. Uh, I don't know what this is. Oh, this is the tent where we can build stuff. Okay, uh, I think we need to get us some materials. Gonna do that. Okay, we got some logs. Great, great, great. Now we can start building the head of the of the Goliath. Man, I like this game. It's really cool. Uh, so basically, you can build robots in an RPG kind of world. That's that's really cool. I really didn't expect something like that. Okay, so we still need um, six more ro logs. So let's destroy nature. <laughs> let's destroy nature, guys. Let's do this. Okay, and we got ourselves some dogs. Great. That's exactly what I want. What do I hear? There are, there are noises somewhere. I don't know. Da -da -da. There we go, got some locks. There we go. Get us some more locks. You never know when you need more locks, so I'd rather have more locks. And it's already day. Well, that wasn't like very long day. Oh, it's another bunny. Let's shoot it in the head. Oh, headshot, bitch. Correct. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I get a little bit excited for this stuff. Oh, I already saw the chest. Uh, let's build a Goliath. Let's build our first robot. I'm really excited what will happen if we buy a robot. Like. Da -da -da -da. Oh my god, it's huge. Wait, can we go inside this robot? Come off, you're there. It's Dave again. I've got big news. Listen, buddy, I don't think we're in the same world. What? This world is made of all these pieces and the, all these bits and pieces and people and the creatures that have been pulled from all over the universe. But they haven't all stuck together like a planet. It's like there's chunks all orbiting around something that at the center. What's at the center? Who knows? Something powerful and dark. I can't see it in the sky. Oh, well, it's probably not important. We should put it out of our minds. So, is this why your radio reception is so wonky? That's the thing! With the way these orbits work, sometimes we swing close to each other and the reception is good and sometimes we're far away and the reception is bad. Sometimes we even completely block from each other and we can't communicate at all. Ah, oh, for crying out loud, I spent all this time building a big armored walking robot thing to get to you and you're not even on the same world! Silver lining Monami. 
You know the portal that's near the black ob obelisk at the base you made? It doesn't work, right? Well, I did some experimenting on mine here, and it just needs a couple things to make it work. A green, a green gem, a little glue, and a stick. Even jury rig it together like that and it'll get you from world to world. Then we can start figuring out how to meet up. Yeah, I know where, where those things are. Okay, I will get on, on it right away. Oh. My. Look at this, guys. We're fucking robots. Oh, this is so cool. This is so awesome. We can even attack. Okay, we can... Oh, shit. So cool. We have our own robot. Man, this is this is awesome. I, I like the graphics of this game. They're really good. I really like this game right now. Ah, you pull up my terra, my terra, my camera, the fucking, the pull up my terra, the da. Woo! Oh, I fucking hate spiders! <laughs> ah, man. I hate spiders. I'm fucking scared of spiders. Ah, oh, luckily I'm a fucking robot. Woo! <laughs> that make me scary. Oh my god, that made me fucking scary right there. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Are there more fucking spiders? No. I hate spiders. What do I hear? Okay, what, what do I hear? Okay, so there's something here. Oh. Okay, where are we going? Hi there, stupid bird. Come on, boy. Come on. Oh. Get wrecked! Get wrecked, motherfucker! Hey, what you gonna do, huh? I now got a robot, you piece of shit! Uh, uh, yeah, bunny. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? I got a robot now, boy! Look at that. Mmm. That's how we do it. If Minecraft had robots, man. This is like, right, Minecraft with robots. It's fucking lit. Oh my, are there's... Oh, there are more spiders there, you're fucking serious. Do we really need to go to a spider? Um, can I see the mini map real quick? No! Oh shit. Well, that was the game. That was Goliath. <laughs> Thank you so much for checking out this video. Just, there was Fritchie and stay Fritchie.